New at 11 tonight, parking is going digital in Fresno. The city is in the process of implementing new technology at Woodward and Roding Regional Park that will change the way you park and pay. Our right, Kirsten Mitchell live at Woodward Park tonight. Kirsten, the good news is the city says they're not going to raise the daily rates despite the upgrade. That is correct, Alex. On if you have those annual passes, you can still use them. Otherwise, it'll still be five dollars a car, three dollars for seniors. But the way you pay will be different. And those I spoke with today had mixed reaction. Some of them have been coming for 15 years, 20 years. When you spend that many years at the same dog park, you get to know every snout. Oh yeah, and the humans too. We usually come at eight. Eight to nine is our usual, but they're not happy with the parking changes coming to Woodward Park. You'll no longer have to stop at the ticket booth and pay someone to park. Instead, you'll drive right in and find your spot and then pay at an electronic kiosk or through the park mobile app. It's the same app used to park in areas of Fresno like downtown. The idea behind this is how do we make the experience better for folks going to the park? How do we make it more efficient so there's not a bottleneck of cars going into Woodward Park? The more than $200,000 plan was approved in September of 2020 and will use license plate recognition cameras. Cameras. If you're going to the park and you're not paying for it, you will be receiving, you know, a ticket in the mail. This is how much you owe. This is how much you should have paid when you went to go to the park. Good boy. These dog lovers think it will turn visitors away. They're either going to park around the outside or, or whatever. And the business owners aren't going to like that. I always prefer why not free because, you know, it's for people to enjoy. Mona Ahmed adopted the dog park more than a decade ago. She wishes the money would be spent on improvements instead. Trees are dying. Look at this. This used to be lush green, lush green. Nothing, nothing. I don't see any penny coming to this park. By investing in this technology, you're going to be able to get in and out of the park so much easier and so much more safely. I think when folks start using the new and improved system, they're going to find it's really a great thing for them and their families. And I spoke with a few other people here at the park today who were on board with this plan. As for a timeline, that depends on what happens tomorrow during a city council meeting. That's where they will vote to approve an additional $25,000 for this technology. Reporting live in Fresno, Kirsten Mitchell, KC24, Local News That Matters.